Hey, morning, Liv. Um, here's my idea for you. This isn't Feldman Christ at all, but say I'm going to take one of my my free hands and I'm going to touch the back of my head right under the, there's a protuberance, a septal protuberance, where you have a little notch in the back of your head. So you go just to the side of that notch, and then I'm going to make a little palpation with my fingers pretty hard, and I'm going to go down about three fingers at a time. And then after I do one palpation, you know, maybe that's five or six oscillations, I'm going to flex my head a couple of times, and then I'm going to keep going. Each time I palpate, I flex my head on my neck. I'm going to go all the way down to the base of my neck, the top of my shoulders, essentially. Okay, and then at the next part, um, I'm going to touch the top of my shoulder the outer on the on the back side of my shoulder the um the top of the shoulder blade um in my world um the, that's the spine of the scapula and so i'm gonna flat or i'm gonna press this guy with the opposite hand and then after i do that i'm gonna flex my right ankle um it's the same ankle as that side and you could do the, you could get the same with flexing your head on your neck if you want to do that instead. It might be easier than thinking about which ankle. I'm going to walk my way about two thirds of the way in on this spine of my scapula. So it's the bony process on the back side of the sh top back side of the shoulder. I walk my way all the way back. I'm going to either flex my head or flex my ankle. Okay, so um, you do that one side and then you switch. You do the same thing on the other side. I'd walk my way down, flex my head, all the way down. And then take my fingers over the top. I'm gonna press down pretty strongly, flex my ankle or flex my head, whichever one, same side in terms of the ankle. Okay, so give that a try. If that doesn't work, just give me a holler, no big deal. Um, I've got some other ideas. Thank you.